Hi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to create a REST endpoint to retrieve the single document from the MongoDB database. So before that, in the previous video, we have created this new request, but I forgot to save this request. So click on this down arrow key and click on this save as and let's specify the request name. I'm going to call this create to do and we're going to store that in the collection Spring Boot MongoDB and click on this save. Okay, so now let's minimize this and let's go ahead and create a new request public and this is going to return a response entity response entity and I'm going to call this sing get single to do and this is going to receive a parameter of type string ID so path variable and I'm going to specify the path variable ID which is of type string and ID and I'm going to annotate this with the at get mapping annotation and I'm going to specify the URL slash to do slash and we're going to specify the path variable and within the curly braces I'm going to specify the variable name which is ID and let me import the path variable and inside this uh, we're going to make use of the to do repository to get the single uh, we're going to find the to do by id so to do repo dot find by id and we're going to specify the we're going to pass the id and this is going to return an optional to do so optional to do dto and i'm going to call this to do optional and let me import this optional from the util package and I'm going to write a condition if to do optional is present then we're going to return a response entity response entity to do optional dot get and we're going to pass the status as 200 else return new response entity and we're going to send a message to do not found with id the id which is looking for the user is looking for and we are going to pass the http status to not found so let's save this so now we have created a rest endpoint to retrieve the single document from the database all we need to do is we have to test our work so let's go to the postman and first of all i am going to switch to the read to do's and click on this send so now we have uh, these two entries so let me take the second id which is pay wi-fi bill or the internet bill so let's copy this and i'm going to create a new request slash to do's slash the id i'm going to change this to get and now we should get this uh, pay internet bill document as a single document so when i click on this send we should get the single document but if i go ahead and change this to something uh, else the different one this is not available and when i click on this send we should get a message to do not found with the id the one which he is uh, looking for okay so which is not available let me switch back to the correct one and we should get the document so let's go ahead and save this request 
and I'm going to call this read to do and I'm going to store it in the collection Spring Boot MongoDB and click on this save all right so now we have created a rest endpoint to retrieve the single document and in the next video we are going to updating the document so that is coming up in the next video i will see you in the next video